Greetings everyone! So, number 26, the last one, is Robin Hood. And it kind of breaks my heart because I absolutely love this guy's design. He kind of reminds me of Kiske Urahara from Bleach and Urahara is like my second favorite character from Bleach. So yeah, and I like his demeanor and all that stuff. Plus, I'm absolutely in love with green color. So yeah, this guy stylish wise is definitely in my top five or something. But unfortunately, oh man, his gameplay is just not for me. So let's begin with his uh, standard combo. Even though you gotta understand one thing, standard combo in this game is kind of worthless because really the only guys that uh, this is threatening to are the regular grunts and while in other Musou games uh, regular grunts matter in this game it's just it's really a wordless filler it's nothing but fodder really the only thing that matters in this game is to take down the, uh, the office officers 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 yeah Generals, you know, the, the bigger grunts, because really the smaller ones, they just don't matter at all. So, yeah, while these moves are flashy and all, and it's, it's really nice to execute them, uh, to the bigger guys, they are just nothing. So, yeah, uh, the bread and butter of the fighting in this game are the abilities so let's look at them all right so my least favorite ability uh, of robin hood is attachment nerve round so let's observe this okay so it looks cool i like the little electrifying effect that it has but uh, check this out okay you see those icons the blue ones they mean business, they are the damage dealers. However, the purple ones, they are just, you know, for uh, restraining movement of the enemy. You know, you paralyze them, which is nice, but it deals no damage. And let me tell you something, if you don't deal any damage, you're screwed. I remember that I once, I went into the fight with basically nothing but, uh, you know, these kinds of attacks i have only one damage dealer i don't remember which character it was i think it was maybe medusa oh man i got freaking raped <laughs> so yeah really uh, this game is only about damage i mean the you know to stop the enemy in their track is nice but you're just buying yourself some time in some dense situation tense situation <laughs> uh, but ultimately, you want to kill the enemy. You don't want to just, you know, stop them. So yeah, uh, get used to seeing these purple icons as usually my least favorites. Usually. All right, so let's continue. Uh, number six for me is Hunter's Rain. Now it looks cool, but if you're in a pinch, uh, this ability is kind of bitch to aim and it takes a while to, you know, initiate, so it's not very practical. Uh, next one, number 5, Poisoned Arrowhead. Now it's nice, but ultimately it's just simple arrow, you know, it's it's nothing to write home about. It's, yeah, it's, it's fast, that's nice, but uh, it's easy to miss. All right, and now number number four is attachment shrapnel. So basically, you know, grenade ability. Uh, nothing super special. Oh, now I realized I kind of fucked up. Sorry, guys. I also consider their super ability into this uh, bunch. Um, I don't know how to call it, it's, it's been ages since I played this game. Basically they are golden ability. So yeah, uh, attachment nerve round was number 8, Hunter's Rain, number 7, Poisoned Arrowhead, number 6, and attachment shrapnel, number 5. So yeah, now let's go to the victorious 4. Alright, so number 4 is uh, 
his only truly melee ability, which is triple kick. No, it looks really dope. I love it. Stylish wise, it's just top. But it's very chaotic and uh, usually you don't hit what you actually want it to hit, so it's not really super practical. But I love it uh, since it's his only truly melee attack and yeah, for that it definitely deserves my praise. Alright, so bronze position number 3 is Faceless King. So first of all, I absolutely love this initializing effect and what this does is that makes you invisible so foes don't pay attention to you and uh, I think that all your attacks uh, basically deal more damage. So yeah, it's, it's a very useful skill. And as you can see, its icon is orange which means that it's kinda like status effect changer or something like that. It, it's basically, usually it's a buff. Yeah, that's that's what it is. Uh, there's also, I think, green icon, which there's only one character that has green icon. And I think that there's also yellow icon, but I'm not sure right now, <laughs> sorry. As I said, it's been ages since I played this game. So, number two, silver position is attachment catapult burst. Very, very cool. Basically, you know, your crossbow is something like a machine gun there. And you can also like change its uh, trajectory or aim. Yeah, you, you can aim with this. See? Bam, 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 bam. Just the way you wish. Okay, so now golden position is his super skill or how to call it. I promise I'll do my research and next time I'll call it by its rightful name. Uh, and you might be like, oh man, Alex, that's not fair, you know, it's obvious that every time their super ability will be number one. Oh, no, 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 my friend. That's the only thing that I can say. You probably waited for some explanation. No, yeah. I can say only no, it's not gonna be that way all the time. <laughs> but yeah, with Robin Hood, it is that way, so let's go. <laughs> Drive skill, that's the name, thank you. <laughs> So yeah, very nice big explosion, I definitely like it. So let's check it, check it out one more time. Yeah, it's basically a miniature of his uh, Noble Phantasm. Noble Phantasm is their ultimate attack, I'm not gonna bother with that, you can check my moveset videos for that. Okay, so that's that, that's number 26, uh, Robin Hood. Uh, honestly, he suffers because he's an archer, and I usually don't like archers in these type of games. It's just not very practical to be archer. In, in Musou type games, you want to be in the face of your opponent, you want to pummel them into the ground. While it sounds safe to be you know, some distance from your foes. In these chaotic games, it's usually not a win situation. Usually. You want you want a good mix. Some long range attack, but you definitely want to cause some harm face to face. And that's something that Robin Hood just doesn't do very well. So I'm not really comfortable playing as him. And uh, yeah, it's just, it's just not enjoyable to play as him. So sorry. Green Archer. I'm sure there are guys who really like you. Okay, so see you next time with number 25.